They seek to establish systems of government based on the regimentation of all human beings by a handful of individual rulers who seize power by force. Yes, these men and their hypnotized followers call this a new order. It is not new, and it is not order. What about the time he cursed the fig tree? You know, pious Christians sometimes make me very angry. They don't even know Christianity. They don't know the man they're following. He was a revolutionary. He was a dangerous man. And by God, so am I. And so should you be. This country was founded by dangerous men. And the moment the people in this country cease to be dangerous men, it's going to be the day we cease to have a country. Their whole goal with this philosophy is to teach all men and women that the only end of life is to seek the utmost pleasure and happiness that you can get out of it because when you die there's nothing else. That's what they teach. That's what they want you to be. They don't want laws against sexual promiscuity. That's why they don't want families. That's why they don't want marriage. That's why they encourage homosexuality. There's a method to their madness. There's really not much method to yours. Because you're operating from a place of ignorance. And until you change that, you're going to be bumbling around, bumping into each other, saying and doing the wrong things, not understanding the nature of your en enemy. And if you don't understand the nature of your enemy and the weapons they use, you cannot fight that enemy! Invisible walls, the wicked sight, geist of life, making grown men crawl on their knees, begging, please save us from the boogeymen. Funded by the CIA, funneled through Arabian banks, like a shank to the neck. They hit you from the back, no sweat. Ho, check and watch us shake and take away your freedom. You really don't need them when you're tucked away, safe and protected by FEMA. Then you must be a dreamer, like the great pretender. Ask the Second Amendment why I'll never surrender, but I'll never plead the fifth when it comes to September. I'm a yeller from the roof. And Expose the agenda yeah. Time to wake up and open your eyes to the matrix This is going out to the troopers and patriots Living free and dying hard, speaking through battle scars An army of one becomes a global resistance Time to wake up and patriot here And I just got mind fucked So I guess all of you are about to now First let me start with this This isn't a thing but it's Just some news I thought I'd show uh, DOD wants contractors to mine your social media posts to develop new ways for the U.S. government to interfere with what you're really thinking and feeling. To predict what you'll do next. 1984! you never seen 1984 in a movie. Highly suggested. Pentagon documents released over the last few months identify ongoing classified research in the area of federal government plans to expand by investing millions more dollars. Because we're so rich and... The unclassified documents, unclassified, which call on external scientists, institutions, and companies to submit proposals for research projects, not only catalog how far U.S. military capabilities have come, but also reveal the Pentagon's goals, building the U.S. intelligence community's capacity to forecast population behavior at home and abroad. Bullshit. Especially groups involved in political activism. There you go. They throw light on the extent to which Pentagon's classified pre-crime R&D has advanced and how the U.S. military intends to deploy its operations around the world. Folks, if you haven't seen 1984 or the movie They Live, 
I would suggest that you see them, because they are both very real. All this shit that I be talking is real. I don't bullshit nobody. Not my worst enemy. This ain't no fucking joke, man. Talking about fucking Mark of the Beast shit here, you know, eyeball retina scans and shit. I want you to pay close attention to this shit. NASA Blue Bean Project has four different steps in order to implement the New Age religion with the Antichrist. Okay, remember, it's a New Age religion. That means one world religion. Uh, and foundation of government. Without that, that, that. Okay, so, without a universal belief in the New Age religion, the success of the New World Order will be impossible. So, this Blue Bean thing is key. And I'll tell you right now, I'm, I'm thinking... Yeah, I'm absolutely sure they're gonna they're gonna fake uh false false return of Christ. So the first step concerns the breakdown of all archaeological knowledge. It deals with the setup with artificially created earthquakes, harp, and certain precise locations on the planet where supposedly new discoveries will finally explain to all people the error of all the fundamental religious doctrines. The falsification of this information will be used to make all nations believe that their religious doctrines are fake. They're misunderstood. Lies. Psychological preparations have already started. They do it through movies and television, which I keep telling you. Jurassic Park, Star Wars. Folks, the shit that they had in Star Wars. They had that for at least 20 years when that movie came out. They've got everything 20 to 30 years ahead of time. You think they just fucking find shit and give it to you? They find out different things they can do with it. They study every fucking way possible they can do with the damn thing before they even sell you the first thing. The, the technology and shit they keep from you is incredible and you don't even know it. And it's right in front of your face. So what's important to understand is the first step is that those earthquakes will hit different parts of the world where scientific and archaeological teachings have in indicated that arcane mysteries have been buried. By those types of earthquakes, it will be possible for scientists to rediscover those arcane mysteries which will be used to discredit all fundamental religious doctrines. This is the first preparation for the plan of, of humanity because they want to destroy the beliefs of all Christians and Muslims on the planet. To do that, they need some false proof from the far past that will prove to all nations that their religions have all been misinterpreted. Folks, I keep telling you, they don't care about your damn religion or your race. So why are we fighting over it? Why do we care? That's the plan. Get us fighting each other. They want to start a civil war in this country. You want to stop the civil war, you keep that in mind. second step involves a gigantic space show with three-dimensional optical holograms and sounds, laser projection of multiple holographic images to different parts of the world, each receiving a different image according to predominating regional national faith. This new God's voice will be speaking in all languages. In order to understand that, we must study various secret services, research done in the last 25 years. Soviets have perfected an advanced computer, even exported them and fed them with the me on minute physio-psychological particulars based on their studies of the anatomy and electromechanical composition of the human body and the studies of the electrical, chemical, and biological properties of the human brain. They want to map your brain. Well, actually, they're already mapping our brains, but they want to download it. And that's exactly what Ray Kurzweil of Google said. They're, they're working on fucking downloading your brain. You'll be fucking like robots. Be able to live forever. Fucking lift incredible strength. Uh, fucking have incredible strength and lift shit. Ugh. These computers were fed as well as with languages of all human cultures and their meanings. The dialects of all cultures have been fed into the computers from satellite transmissions. 
uh, they resorted to suicide. Um, also seen Soviets, the New World Order people have resorted to suicidal methods within the human society by allocating electronic wavelengths for every person in every society and culture to induce suicidal thoughts. I, how many fucking times do... How much mind control have I done on you? What the fuck, man? This is incredible. I mean, this shit is all written out and, and nobody fucking gets it. Listen, this is all in the Bible. And the Bible is the only fucking book in the world that has... To the letter, been coming true, especially recently, I would highly suggest, especially for those of you who don't really want to read or care about the Bible, no, no, you want to go and read Revelations. I promise you, you do. Uh, ask yourself why they took the book of Enoch out of the Bible. You don't know why then you don't know what the book of Enoch is although I talk about it all the time uh, right under your nose and you probably don't notice listen folks folks damn man don't you understand what the fuck is happening here This ain't shit to fucking joke around about and, and argue with each other. We need to be doing some serious fucking shit here. Tell you if this dude comes back. I mean, uh, all of this is inevitable. It's all inevitable. But we are supposed to do something. We're not supposed to sit on our fucking ass and watch football. And reality shows and not give a fuck about anything. It's supposed to be preaching this man's word. And we haven't been. Which is why the fucking world has become indoctrinated with the fucking devil. Look at this shit, okay? And you can click on all of the fucking links right up here. And see everything. All this shit you've been seeing around the world, the fucking floating cities in the sky, uh, how about a fallen angel? Look at this shit. Watch, watch, watch. What's that? What's that? What's that? Now watch. Watch. Watch, watch, watch. Watch, watch. See that? You see that? Did you see that motherfucker fly across the sky? All right, you see what the fuck is going on here? Or do I got to throw the fucking Bible at you? Fucking people are saying it's got something to do with the, the microwaves or something like that. No, it's got to do with the fucking Bible. I try very hard not to swear, believe me, I do. I really do. I get highly upset about this information. <sighs> Let's see that again. There he goes.
Now this could be Bluebeam in use. But since they're fucking fallen angels, I highly doubt it. I doubt it. I, I, I'm pretty sure it, it, that that's real. Oops. Look. Look. This is an orange. Uh, uh, orange California. Look. Now watch it. Watch. Watch. It looks like somebody with a fucking jetpack on, right? Ah, that... That definitely looks like some blue bean shit. You can tell, like, by the colors. Looks like a space man. There's more and more and more and more and more. And more. <laughs> oh, shit. Telling folks. China has been working on developing these cities. These these blue beam projects for years they have perfected it I don't know if ours is better I would assume that we have the best technology because we're the new Nazis and uh, let's let's get another thing clear here class you are not a US citizen you are a private citizen Understood? If anybody asks you. You're a private citizen. A what? United what? Never heard of it. God bless, carry on.